Did you know the largest employer of young people in New Haven is LEAP, an organization designed to help young people in the Elm City? And it does that through sports, camping, cooking, college prep, and a lot more. News 8 anchor Scott McDonald has the story in What's Right with Schools. Leadership, education, and athletics in partnership. Do you all know what it is to broil? LEAP works within five New Haven neighborhoods. The heat is going to come from the top. They're not only some of the poorest communities in the state, but the poorest you'll find in the entire nation. We work with about 550 kids at any one time um, and about uh, uh, 1,200 kids over the course of, of a year. So the opportunity to participate in free programs provided by LEAP. I feel happy here. Like swimming. Go! Has many kids diving in. LEAP plays a very important role in that we have a great after school programming and we have a great uh, six week summer camp. Access to pools for inner city kids is limited. But the lessons taught go beyond that. Swimming is life saving. According to the CDC, African American kids drown at 5.5 times the rate of other children. They're taught by young local leaders in training. That's what I like about LEAP. Is it because the people that you meet are, and you know are the people that help you grow? Like Nazir Peters, giving back to a place that has given to him. I've been with Leap since I was uh, 12, and they've looked out for me ever since then. Now at UConn, it was Leap that helped him get into college. We had an SAT prep program a few years ago, college tours, they helped me make a decision on where I wanted to go. Helping to make life changing decisions. Let's give that just a quick second. And learning life improving skills like cooking. Oh, they look amazing. But the state budget shortfall has slashed LEAP state funding. All righty. By more than half. But it's always a struggle to raise the money necessary to keep LEAP and organizations like LEAP running. Partners and private donors have stepped up and many more are needed. That's incredibly important for us to be able to keep this organization running. Hanging in the balance. A compassionate compass for countless kids and teens in New Haven. To be an engineer. Pointing them towards success. In New Haven, Scott McDonald, News 8. If you have a tip about what's right at your school, we'd love to know about it. You can tell us through email, social media, or send your idea through the reported feature built right into our free News 8 app.